Heath Ledger had a huge following among young movie fans. He also made quite an impact on his co-stars. Mel Gibson said he had great hope for Ledger. Another fellow Aussie, Kate Blanchett, says she always admired his development as an actor. You're just too good to be true. Can't take my eyes off of you. In 10 Things I Hate About You, Ledger showed he had a way with the song. He was barely 20 years old, but he had star power. I have to get these dispatches to Hillsborough. You're in no position to write. Ledger followed up with a role as Mel Gibson's son in The Patriot, a big part in a big movie. He was definitely on his way to the top. Evening, Commissioner. Ledger got the coveted role of the Joker, Batman's nemesis in The Dark Knight. The movie is now in post-production and scheduled for a July release. It's not about me anymore, it's all about him. In last year's I'm Not There, Ledger appeared as one of singer Bob Dylan's incarnations. He explained it to dailies at a noisy red carpet premiere. More of a portrait of Dylan than my character itself, like kind of chronicling his love life and his romance and his... Um, this is ridiculous. I can't hear a thing. I'm sorry, I'll get it from the We had a lot going for us. Ledger played a heroin addict in Candy. At the New York premiere in 2006, he told dailies about family matters at home in Australia, where the film had been shot. I had my wife and my daughter was, uh, you know, inside the belly by a month. So it was, that was very early days. It was quite a while ago. I bet you fix this place up around us if you wanted to. Although they never married, Ledger and actress Michelle Williams became close during the filming of Brokeback Mountain and had a child together. Ledger would earn an Oscar nomination for his performance as a cowboy whose marriage is complicated by his love for fellow cowboy Jake Gyllenhaal, a poignant performance of an unfulfilled life. Well, I guess I'll see you around, huh? Okay.